Hello everyone, welcome back to another amazing video. Guys, you won't believe that you can get the Microsoft Office 2024 with the license key and that also officially. So just follow the process as I am showing you right here. So if you have any earlier versions, just make sure to uninstall all the programs so that it can work smoothly. So once you are done with the uninstallation process, just follow the complete process. Now, first of all, just go to this website that I will link in the description of this video. Now just check the requirements that if you are able to install that successfully or not, and if your system supports that, and if you're using the relevant version of the windows. Now here on the top, you can see this download option right here. Just click on the download option and just choose your download location and download this file. So what you can do is just go to the C drive right here and create this folder with the exact same name. Just create this folder. As you can see the folder name, just make sure it is exactly like this. And now what you can do is just copy the downloaded file from the downloads to that folder. I'll just go to this folder and paste it right here. And now just click on run as administrator, click on yes. I accept, continue. Now it will ask you for the path, just set the path that you just created the folder in and just select that folder in that path, click OK, and it will be extracted. The files will be extracted successfully and now you have the set of files. Now, once you're done with the extracting, what you can do is just go to the second website that I will link in the description. That is also the official website. And just scroll down until you see this XML configuration files, just copy that. And just open the notepad and paste it right here, like this. Now, since we are not using the other products like Visio and Project, so what you can do is just select from here, from this point up till this particular point. Only keep the first one and the language ID. Let's remove the rest. And here it's asking you for some ID. Now here we need a key here. So let's scroll down and let's see. This is the official key that is provided. Just copy that and paste it right here within the inverted commas. Now here I can just go to a file and save as and just choose the location in the C drive and under this folder that we just created. Now here just notice this very important step. Just write the configuration in the small letters and write here this extension as well XML dot XML and just save that. Make sure the spellings are correct. Now the final step is what you can do is just go to the CMD from the start menu and right click to run it as administrator and click yes. Now here we will write something like this CD space and put a forward slash hit enter. And now we will write CD and name the folder, which is this hit enter. And now we are in the folder. Now from here, just we have to scroll up where we see this key. Uh, just scroll a little bit up and just go to the console section and just copy this code right here and paste it in the command prompt and hit enter and it will start the installation process. And now we can see that the installation process is started. So just sit back and relax while it installs the software. And now you can see that our software is installed. Let's close this and let's see here. Just go to the start menu and open any application like Excel. So from here, just go to the account and you can see that if this message appears, you can click on change here and just go to the same website where I went earlier and just scroll a little down and use this second key right here. Just paste it right here and click on this option. And now if we check again, just go to the home tab and click on account again. You can click on updates or click on update now and it says you are up to date. Now let's open any other application and now your preview version is enabled. So that's it. This is how you can completely access all of the office apps. If you found this video helpful, just hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell. Also mention down in the comment if that works and I'll see you in the next one.